back again and we have another video we're going to be looking at for uh, indoor. Uh, I know this is supposed to have, uh, what's his name from Solo, not Solo, uh, Rogue One. Let's let's see what happens. Let's see let's see what we got here, and uh, we'll go we'll go from there. Everything I did, I did for the rebellion. Rogue One, in many ways, it's a film that connected new audiences with the, the oldest fans. It was a bittersweet feeling, you know, in the premiere, knowing that it was just one film. But then magic happens, right? As you can see, we're getting ready. We're building stages, we're rehearsing, we're training, we're trying costumes, we're doing everything to make sure we do the best show. I'm really excited having the chance to explore Cassian. It's really fun to go on a set that is emulating something you like so much. The enormity of this is like doing a big feature film. It's very cinematic. For me, that's where the excitement is. 12 episodes, 12 scripts, over 200 named cast members, over 6,000 crowd people, a lot of creatures that come in from the creature department. We treat this exactly like we would have would have filmed. There is no difference in our approach. Every creature and droid that we've been building has the same care, level of attention, to detail as the previous films. It's huge, it's thrilling, but also it's wonderfully challenging. There's tons of possibilities to explore. It is the building of a revolution. <laughs> I'm willing to give it a shot, guys. I'm willing to give it a shot. I'm not a big fan of Cassian. Uh, was not a fan of his character uh, in Solo. Not Solo. I keep saying Solo. Rogue One. I like Rogue One. It's not a bad uh, movie. I did enjoy it. I just I did not enjoy his character. Uh, I'm hoping that maybe his character change. Obviously, this is probably going to happen before Rogue One. Obviously. Um and obviously, it's probably going to be before uh, New Hope as well. So, I don't know. We're going to wait and see till we actually get an, uh, a trailer. You know, this is the first quote-unquote look. So, it did say that we were going to be getting 12 episodes of this, uh, which I don't understand why we're getting 12 episodes of this and we can't get 12 episodes of The Mandalorian, which is absolutely ridiculous because of how high. And honestly, let, let's be honest here. This show would not happen if we didn't have Mandalorian. I'm just going to say that right now. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. And as always, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Let me know what you guys think. More videos coming. Stay tuned. And uh, whatever I see uh, about Star Wars, uh, again, if it interests me or if uh, it's going to be relevant to Star Wars, I'm going to do my best to get it on the channel for you guys and give you guys my thoughts as well as my thoughts on it. So let me know what you guys think about it. And uh, we'll talk soon.